here, Sadie. Come here, Sadie. I promised everyone a cameo. They want to see you, girl. Look at my baby. You good girl, baby. Come, kid, kid. Come, kid, kid. Yeah, my baby. I love my baby, Sadie. You good girl? Hmm? Aw, she's so cute. She leaves her, leaves her head against me. You good girl? Come, kid, kid. Thank you. Okay. You can go now. Anyways. What's good, YouTube? Everyone, you two here back again once again. Today, people, today we're for episode number seven of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee Let's Play here on the channel. It's still launch weekend. Is that a thing? Is launch weekend a thing? We're going to make it a thing. It's still launch weekend. Uh, and we are standing here with Sexy Bill, the newest sex icon of the Kanto region. Uh, and we just received tickets to the SSN, and we're about to step out these doors and throw fisticuffs with the next coach trainer that's standing outside his house. So, if you guys are hyped for some more Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, and of course, I'm going to show you support the Prime of the Lampy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Now, super quick team recap for you guys. Up first, we have Big Dishes, our newly evolved Pidgeotto, level 19. Thickums, our Ivysaur, level 19. Sadie, our Pikachu, level 18. Magnolia, our Magikarp, level 13. I didn't push any button. Wendy, our Judy, level 17, and Barbara, our Clefairy, level 13. So, let us see here if we can actually smack up this coach trainer. Hey! Hey, let me tell you something! This area is popular for dates. I'm a proudly independent coach trainer that don't need no man at a date spot. I'll let you know I'm, I'm pretty strong. Want me to battle you? Yes. I'll give you a real workout. Like a tongue workout? You trying to make out? Out here? Is that what you're trying to say? Coach Trainer Amala. Ooh, Amala! Come here! Bring that Machop here, girl! Oh, that was your first mistake. Uh, uh, see, I, was, I told you we were going to smack this Coach Trainer up, dog. 100%. Uh, wing attack. Sorry, Machop. Yeah, yeet! How? How? Oh! 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 All right, all right, I see you. Unless you got a priority thunder punch. Goodbye. Coach trainer, my asshole. Fuck out of here. Don't ever ask me to fight again. Well, I technically I asked to fight her. But you said you were strong, Amala. Am I the one who was coached? Ooh, she's blushing. Look. I need to get her to digits. Is that, the, is that the cool kids still say these days? The digits? The deets? The 411? Whew, I hadn't had fun like that in a long time. Here, take this. Is your phone number on the inside of this TM? TM15 is for Seismic Toss. It deals damage equal to the level of the Pokemon that uses the move. Thanks, lady. All right, Big Dishes is put in the work. Magikarp, take us back to Cerulean City, damn it. Take us back to Cerulean City. I need to heal up Big Dishes. Look at all these fucking losers we're passing. <laughs> that bitch is still out here. That nigga is doing the most. Whoa, 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 Magnolia, what is it? Do you smell something, Magnolia? What is it? What is it, boy? Magnolia found something in the plants. It's always a raspberry. It's never anything else. It's just always a raspberry. It's not always a raspberry. Sometimes it's a pinhead berry. I don't understand this. There's an entire piece of land here that leads right up here. Who the fuck built this expensive ass golden ass bridge? That's so excessive. Oh shit! Hey, give me back my Pokeball! I always thought Officer Jenny had like a real slow smoker voice. Squirtle! Whoa. Oh, how could it do such a thing? I need to keep an eye on this house. Get back here! What a mischievous Squirtle. I like how the trainer turns and looks at it like, ha huh, now it's time. Now it's time. That witch is gone. It's time. But I want to heal. And I think we're going to rock with Big Dishes until he's level 20. Because by then, Big Dishes and Thickum should both be level 20. And hopefully, um, Wendy should have a move that we can use or something. I don't know. It might be... It might be uh, Pikachu time again, because both Magnolia and Barbara are too underleveled. If Magnolia would hit level 20 already and stop flipping around, 
then perhaps we could do something with that, but lo and behold, lo and behold. All right, knock, knock, bang, bang, where the cash at? Oh, Pika. Pika. Detective Pikachu is on the fucking case. Pika? Is there a clue? Those are humongous tracks, dog. They're bigger than Pikachu. My nigga, that raspberry is humongous. Holy shit. My nigga, they broke a hole in your wall. That is not just like a small, that's a whole ass fucking man-sized hole. That's wild. But hey, thank you, Pikachu. Thank you, Sadie, for letting me know that something happened. Magic, get the fuck out of the way. Something happened here, and the footprints led over to this giant hole in the wall. I don't think I would have caught that if Pikachu hadn't pointed that out. Team Rocket must be really trying to dig their way into something no good. Look at what Team Rocket have done to my house. And they stole my team, the one that can teach Pokemon like Mankey and Sandshrew the move Dig. And Pikachu, by the way. BT dubs. That was the longest, most awkward loading screen ever. Hey! Hey, stay out! It's not your yard! Huh? Me? I'm an innocent bystander, don't you believe me? I like how on the inside of that house, like in the middle of the wall, it was blown up. On the outside of the house, it's the entire wall. I will never get tired of seeing that battle transition, ever. Can we just battle all Team Rocket members from here on out? Formal request, Game Freak, give us a Team Rocket edition. I know we have the ROM hack, make it a real thing. Please and thanks. Please and fucking thanks, Doug. All right, now, as president, bug. I want more than one fucking headbutt flinch. We only got one. This nigga's gonna quick attack me. He didn't. What a fool. What a fool! And you know, I was gonna mention something at the start of this episode. I mentioned at the end of the last episode, and I said I was gonna save it. I was no, I wasn't gonna save it. I was gonna mention it again at the start of this episode. But I can't remember what the fuck I was gonna mention. Was it about the team? I don't think it was about the team. Okay, I'll return the team on my stole. What do you mean, just give it to me? I better get moving. Bye. So if I go over here and talk to this dude. Is he just gonna tell me to keep it? Oh, you retrieved the TM? Thank you very much. You can keep that though. I've decided to take my time training Diglett to have them learn dig that way. A what? That make no fucking sense. Alright, anyways. I wanna heal up, because Super Fang took half my fucking HP. <laughs> it's annoying as dick, but it took half my fucking HP, so. Yeet skeet. Yeet the absolute skeet. Thank you, come again. Alright, so we are Vermilion City bound. No, I am not a Daniel Bryan fan. AJ should have kept the belt. I'd rather see AJ versus Brock than Daniel versus Brock. Yo, that is today. Probably right now as you're watching this, by the way. Bringing the fourth wall. But, no, I'm not a fan. Okay. Whoa! Sadie has a present for me. When did you make this? My entire heart! Come here. Come here. Yes. Yes, you are just so fucking adorable. Yes. Stop doing that. Stop! Stop moving your hand like that. Yes, I wanna touch these cheeks. Look at these fucking cheeks. Look at these fucking cheeks. I'm gonna grab this one too. Stop it. Can I get a high five? Ow, 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 no, no, no! All right, thank you, Sadie, for that present. That was wonderful. That was glorious. That was magnificent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't thank you enough. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, Magikarp, it's not a race. 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 Calm down. Calm down. You ain't gotta run in front of me like that. I'm the trainer here. Only one of us can fit through the door, Magikarp. Fucking relax. It's fucking doofus. They should have other mods like Drowsy do that as well. Just walk all out of order and shit. Oh, we almost fucked that up. Okay, so cut bush as expected. Excuse me. All right, magic card. If I juke this nigga out, can I? Can I? Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. You gonna walk behind me, boy? Whether you like it or not, boy. God damn it. That chick is ugly. Go back inside. 
You're too ugly for the outside world. Go back inside, please. Um, alright, so... We need to explore ties, Route 5. I'm gonna go down here and then back up. There's a Growlithe. Because this should be the daycare, right? Whoa, 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 whoa. Grab this ether, too. We got an ether last episode, an ether in this episode. How many episodes in a row can we get ethers? Oh, Shady's guarding this house. Hold on, Shady. I'll get there in just a moment. Oh. No, 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 Magnolia. You're just in the way, Magnolia. Huh. We stay with these hidden items, dog. We stay with these hidden items, dog. You know, I think I'm gonna leave a mod in the nursery. In the nursery? In the nursery. <coughs> I opened my mouth to speak. Spit went down the wrong pipe. Hey there, the name's Mr. Hyper. Is your wife's name Miss, Mrs. Super? Listen closely now, my young friend, if you ever achieve the title of champion, be sure to come back here and see me. I'll be waiting. Oh. I'm the daycare lady. I look after and raise the Pokemon of trainers who leave them here with me. Now then, what would you like to do? You know what? I will drop him on off. Please choose the Pokemon you like. No, I don't. Why does that have to be on my team? Never mind. I take it back. Never fucking mind. Never mind. You just gotta be difficult about it. I would leave them on, but I don't feel like swapping mons and doing all that extra shit just to leave them on there. Alright, boy! I want that item, and I wanna see what else spawns here. Wasn't there, like, hidden items around here somewhere? On this part of the route? God damn it! Magnolia, I might have to swap you out if you keep doing this. I can't click on hidden items. If you're constantly in front of me like this. Hey, back up. We got Growlithe and Rattata. Bet you're hitting that in that bush. <gasps> Jigglypuff! Jigglypuff, please come here! 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 Please come here. I need you to come and see me. I want the Jigglypuff. I want the Jigglypuff. I want the Jigglypuff. You know, I mentioned using a fairy type in this playthrough, and I wanted to use Jigglypuff because I feel like everyone's gonna use Clefable. And come to find out, I was talking to Mo. Mo used a Clefable. Nexus has a Clefable. Everybody's got a fucking Clefable. I want Jigglypuff. Barbara might. Oh, there's an Abra! I left area so it reset. Fuck! Growlithe is cool, but I want that Abra and I want that Jigglypuff. Pidgey's dope, but I already have one. Watch, the moment I jump down here, they're gonna spawn. No, there's three Pidgeys and a Growlithe here. I don't want this! I was very clear <laughs> about what I wanted. There's Abra. I think a Jigglypuff just spawned. That's, this is so ass. Like, this area right here is so ass. Because you just change areas, so everything that spawns respawns. Except where the fuck did that Pidgey come from? I'm gonna chill right here. I'm gonna chill right here. We're gonna get to Vermilion City, I promise. But, I wonder if there's a limit of, like, what can spawn on a route. <gasps> it's a big and two! It's a big and two! Yeah, boy! It's huge! Nah, bring that ass down here. Bring that ass down here, girl. No! How do you... Am I supposed to, like... Oh, that would have been it! How fucking far can you go? Yeah, boy! You see that? Look at the flick of the wrist! Yeah! Look at the flick of the wrist! Yeah! Let me catch that motherfucking jiggly puff! God damn it! I got some decision making to do now. Barbara or Jigs here? What do I name a jiggly puff? They both take moonstones to evolve. I don't know why Jigglypuff takes a moonstone to evolve. It uses its cute round eyes to enrapture its foe. Then it sings a pleasing melody that lulls the foe to sleep. 
tuck the Jigglypuff away in the Pokemon box in your bag. Hmm. I got some decision making to do here. Some really tough decision making to do. Uh, I did see an Abra though. And I don't know, how are you supposed to get an Abra? Because I walked towards it and it teleported away. So like, how do you actually get an Abra? I'm gonna have to add Abra to the list of mons to come back and get. I still need to go back and get a fucking Nidorino. Oh! I wasn't even moving. How do you get Abra? Like, actually, how do you get Abra? It just, it, it spawned in and teleported away. Am I just supposed to run back and forth until it runs into me? Or spawns on top of me? I'm gonna give it one more chance. I'm gonna give it one more chance and see what happens. Let me see. I want you to know, this would be ass for Shiny Hunters. Because the way you Shiny Hunt in this game is you, like, reset the area and then you come back. This would be absolute ass for Shiny Hunters. Because, like, as you're running back up the side of the route, if a shiny were to spawn, you just can't get it. Can't get it. You have to leave the area, go to Celadon City, and reset it as you come back down. It's another huge Jigglypuff. Abra? Hello? Abra? Another Jigglypuff. I get cornered by Pidgeys. Fuck off, Doug. Fuck off, Doug. I need this Abra, Doug. For half a second just now, I thought the Abra spawned on top of me. I was about to say, fuck yes. Well, if this Abra is anything like Abra in Pokemon Go, if you don't catch it on the first ball, it automatically just disappears. Fuck it, this thing ain't spawning, dog. He's the rare encounter. I could probably drop a lure, but... Oh, well. Oh, well. Shady, what's popping? Oh, hey, Nappy! What's going on, bro? Peas and carrots, peas and carrots. Seems like we can't pass through the gate here. But the underground paths should take us to Vermilion City. It's a bit dark and spooky, though. Huh? Hold one, hold still for one second, Nappy. If he breathes in my ear. I was wondering what that sparky thing was that was stuck in your hair. The well, fuck that I have a whole ass revive in my hair. What? Revives can heal Pokemon that have been knocked out in battle. I had a few extra, so here, take some of mine too. God. Uh, this is the most helpful nigga I've ever seen in my life. God damn. Maybe those will help you when you take on the next gym. Huh? Are those SS tickets you have? Here, take one. You can have one, Shady. You gave me two of your revives, so here you take this. Hey, are you sure I can have this? You know I'm definitely going, right? Where'd you get this anyway? Ah! You got it from that talking Pokemon? What? Oh, it was a person after all. Well, I guess that's good to hear. Hey, just uh, forget about that whole thing, okay? I think I'll press on ahead. See you there. You know, I just noticed he's wearing green and blue's in the game and we're playing as red. That's lit. Oh shit, I accidentally clicked the button. Sorry, Sadie, not right now. Not right now, we can't play with you every five minutes. When my Pokemon is on my shoulder, it will let me know when it when its tail, with its tail, when there's an item on the ground nearby. Oh, thanks, dog. So if you don't have a Mon that's following around that will go and find the item, I guess your Pikachu will do that, or your Eevee will do that as well. Why why even code repels into the game? There's no point. Actually, you want know Magikarp? Let's race. Let's race, Magikarp. Line up right here. You're on the blue, I'm on the red. Let's get it. No, you're supposed to be on the blue. Magikarp. Ma Magikarp. Ma 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 Magic. All right. No, so you stay. You st stay in your lane. 
Thank you. Thank you. No, 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 no. You're on the... Sure. What are you worried about? Because it's dark and creepy in here? It looks slightly relieved. Maybe if you would stop cheating, you wouldn't have anything to worry about. If you aren't up to no good, then you shouldn't be anxious. You shouldn't worry about anything. Are you the bitch that wants to trade? The lighting's not great in the underground path. People drop a lot of things down there, I hear. A lot of hidden items, is that what you mean? So they took the trade chick away. I thought there was a chicken here that wanted to trade. I have upsetment. All right, boys. Route six. I'm telling you, we are g -g 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 getting to the freaking verm vermilion today, boy. We took on a shit ton of trainers last episode. We're about to smack all these things on this route, too. Excuse me. You're actually in the way. Again, in the way. Wait, Pikachu's tail is moving. You see it? Move! Magnolia, please, dog. Please. You're, I bet you it's, it's centered in the, in the middle. Yeet. Don't mind if I do, boy. Whole ass rare candy, too. Oh, I'm going to smack all these trainers. Give me one second. Give me just one second. I'm going to smack all these trainers. Come here. I got mines to get to level 20. I got mines to get to level 20 that I'm trying to level up for this next gym battle. What level is Geodude Evolve? Let's find out. Gentlemen, Edward, give me just one moment. Okay, Google. What level does Geodude Evolve? According to Wikipedia, Bulba Garden, Geodude is a dual type rock ground Pokemon introduced in Generation I. It evolves into Graveler starting at level 25, which evolves into Golem when traded. Holy shit. Level 25. That's a long time to keep a goddamn Geo, dude. Uh, well, I guess we're not going to have a Graveler in time for this next gym. Uh, but I forgot that we need to trade it to evolve Golem. And here I was talking about we we're going <laughs> to... Last episode I said we weren't going to use Machamp, so we we're going to have two trade evolutions with um, Gengar and Machamp. And I was like, no, we only have one. Yeet Skeet, we have Golem to evolve or Graveler to evolve into Golem, which would be two still. But Golem's not a permanent member of the team, so we might not ever actually end up getting Golem. We might... Oh, there goes an Abra. Is this a double battle? Nope. Why? Why can't we have a double battle in this game? I think you should put a double battle in this game. This game's perfect for double battles. I mean, if you have two Joy-Cons, you can just tag team and smack the shit out of people. But you don't... They, you don't, I don't think you double team, you don't double battle them anyways. They still need to send out one mom, which literally makes no sense. That defies all logic of Pokemon since the beginning. But oh well. But yeah, so we might not even end up with a golem. It just depends on when. Yeah, boy. I told you, as your president, I guarantee flinch headbutts at least one per episode. We had one last episode, now we have one in this episode. But depending on when we find Rhyhorn, we may or may not get a golem. If we end up finding out that Rhyhorn is until very late in the game, which I could see them putting Rhyhorn in, like, Victory Road or some shit. Actually, I'm pretty sure you can find Rhydon in Victory Road in regular Gem 1. So if that's the case, then... That would suck. Look at that! Two headbutt flinches in one episode, ladies and gentlemen. I think that's more than enough to warrant re-election. So what I'm gonna do real quick is... Make a list. Make a whole whore-ass list. We need... Nidoran, which I still have to go so far back to get, in an Abra right now. Those are the Mons that I've seen that we need to get. Uh, there's also the Bulbasaur to pick up and the Charmander. But we need body counts for those. <laughs> Literally. We need <laughs> numbers of Mons that have been caught to get those. So that's unfortunate. Hey. Who's there? Quit listening in on us. No one's listening in on you. You two are just standing here. And I'm trying to run hands, Camper Ricky. Come through and catch these hands, boy. B -b -b boy Go on, Big Dishes. I know you can do it. Look, y'all ready for another headbutt flinch? We get nothing but excellent throws and nothing but headbutt flinches. I told you! That's three headbutt flinches in a row, dog. 
Well, not in a row, but three episodes, three headbutt flinches in this episode alone. It's insane. It's insane, Doug. Now, what you guys don't know is that quick attack bypasses accuracy. See? Because the attack moves so fast. It didn't have time to be accurate. It's just bam, hits you. That's how fast this shit moves. Share that bit of knowledge with all your friends. Speaking of Midoran, I just jotted this motherfucker's name down. I need you for my Pokédex. I need you for my Pokédex. P -p -p Pokédex. Yeah, boy. Hey, hey don't you. Now, I can't imagine that since after 4th gen when they changed the, the poison in the overworld thing, which I honestly, I disagree. I don't think they should have ever done that. I mean, obviously, every generation they've been making the game easier and easier and easier, except for Ultra and Ultra Moon. That game is actually difficult. We've discussed this a million times, though. But aside from that, are you really like one experience point from leveling up? What the fuck? I can't see them changing that for this game. Nope. Sure as hell didn't. Damn, Growlithe! Oh, relax! Shit! Motherfucker just pulled right the fuck up. There's a Growlithe behind you, sir. I've never seen you around. Are you good? This nigga's got a fucking belly on him, too! Dog, there's no in-between. This nigga. Why are sailors fat? Why, Game Freak, why do you make sailors fat? <laughs> why do you make sailors fat? I don't get it. <laughs> Is that a trend that I, like, I've missed out on? Fat sailors? <laughs> We're poisoned and confused, but have no fear. Big dishes need literal one point of experience to level up. So he's gonna land this quick attack. As your president, I can guarantee you, we will land this quick attack. And after that, we're going to Washington. Yaw! Oh no, he said to the White House. Yaw. All right, I said I want to get big dishes to level 20, and we did just that. And it's good because I don't think Sailor Elijah hit the Stairmaster. I don't think we're going to be using Big Dishes again until like Erica's gym, probably. Because we have an electric gym next and then an entire rock tunnel. So, unfortunately, Big Dishes, I don't think this is your chance to shine. Um, I just need Wendy to learn a ground type move. Okay, when Wendy levels up, no, when Barbara levels up, I should use it on Barbara. And again, I don't know if I'm going to be using Barbara. I don't know if I'm going to be using Barbara. We might not be using that Jigglypuff. Let me jot down Moonstone. Let me jot down Moonstones, damn it. Oh, Pikachu's tail's not wagging. That's what I should pay attention to. Is the wag of the tail. Actual double battle? Actually? Nope. Got my hopes up for absolutely nothing. <laughs> absolutely nothing. This bitch got a Charmander. Wait, I thought they had like Butterfree and like a Venonat or some shit before. I just swapped to this Mon. Headbutt. As your president, I can guarantee you a headbutt per episode. Headbutt flinch per episode. Now, to be fair, we got some headbutt flinches in the bank. The next two episodes are covered because we got three today. Yeah. No, 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 no. That's super effective. Stop. What in the fuck is going on? Is this fuck with the King Nappy Day? Uh, not a fan, by the way. Get yeeted. Get yeeted, my child. Be gone, thought. We're burned, so our headbutt and our vine will do less. I think I might have burned with Ember like twice in my entire life. This nigga clicks Ember once and burns. What? Oh, that's why I wasn't double battle. They couldn't see me. It only go, they only go so far as the path extends. Sure. Sure thing. Camper, yeah. Come here, boy. Bring me that bell spot, boy. Oh, this is gonna be rough. We're burned. Our headbutts are gonna do like no damage. I can't poison powder, I can't leech seed. A poison grass type really fucks with my entire plan. You know what would be lit right now is a goddamn Magmar. Motherfucking Magmar with clean house against this Bellsprout. Uh, what am I doing here? 
I need you to swap. And honestly, the only other thing I can send out is big dishes. Dog, what's going on? Fighting all these trainers got our team struggling. Excuse me. Stop that. You just clicked Vine Lip on a grass poison type, by the way. You're dumb as hell. Alright, be gone, thought. I don't need you on my screen no more. I just need the experience from your Pokemon. Yo. Yo. Okay. Thickums is level 20 as well. Excellent. 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 Did it. Okay, get me out of here, please, and thank you. Oh, you found your Squirtle, did you? Yeet's geet. Let me in this bitch. We have made it, we have traveled far and wide, and have successfully ended up here in the motherfucking Pokemon Center in Vermilion City. I promise you, as your president, we'll make it to Vermilion City. And we did in fact make it to Vermilion City. And the next stop will in fact be the White House. Yeah. But I think it's enough. Let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee for today. I'm gonna wrap up today's episode here. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee. And of course, I'm gonna show you support as a proud member of the Nappy Nation. Make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And I'll catch you guys next time. Until then, I'm out this bitch. Bye!